everyone. Um, it's time to do some Japanese lessons. This one's from Busu website. Uh, today we're gonna do lesson 41 that says uh, for katakana mami mume mo. So katakana is um, a um, system of writing in Japanese. All right, let's check this out. Oh. Katakana mami mume mo. Nine minutes. Hope it's just nine minutes. Vocab start. Welcome to the next lesson. I guess this is the characters mean katakana. Katakana. The next katakana lesson. Um, ka. We already know all the letters from A to Ho. Today, let's study the next five, one of which is my favorite. But first, let's quickly review the katakana that we've already reviewed. Mm, sounds like a plan. Okay, so under H, um, the first column has a sound so first one you see there um, I look at it it's like an inverted V but um, not fully connected right like V I'll turn upside down that's ha that's a yeah, ha and underneath that one ha that's he he looks like a letter T well small letter T uh, that's, so that's he. I guess that helps you remember he, t, t, he, t, he. Small letter T has the sound of he. Okay. Actually, mm, foo. Looks like basically number seven. Foo. Seven foo. Seven foo. Seven foo. Number seven looks like the number seven has the sound of foo, seven foo. And next, this is a true inverted V uh, underneath the seven foo. And that means he, he, that's a, it has the sound of he. Inverted, se, inverted V is he. V he, V he, think of that. V he, inverted V has the sound of he, V he. And uh, lastly, for the uh, huh series, that's ho. And um, you look at the character, it looks like a letter T with some, uh, maybe it has wings, T with wings. So that's ho, ho, ho. Or you can think of it as a person with a very thick armpit hair. So that person is like a ho. Ho, ah. If that helps you remember, that's all. You don't have to think of it that way. Um, next, next column, we work with a N. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, so how, it, how they go, they go like na, ni, nu, na, ni, nu, ne, no. Na, ni, nu, ne, no. So under the end, the first one, that's na. It looks like a cross. Na. So think cross, cross, na. Think of cross, na. Na sound and associated with the cross. Na. Na. Na cross. Na cross. And next is ni. Ni. And you see that there's um, two horizontal lines, right? That's the knee. Two. Um, I don't know if it's just coincidence, but I've noticed that um, it was a knee. That's um, number two in uh, in Japanese. So, you know, we're in counting. You see, each knee, san, shi, knee is number two. And, and this character has two lines. So... I don't know which came first, whether it's the number or the character itself. And they said, these are two lines, you call this, we use, we'll use this to say two. Or was it two, the number two first, and they said. Anyway, so that's ni, ni. Two lines, ni. Na, ni, so review, na, the cross, na, cross. 
Plus Ni Tu And Nani Nu Nu um, It looks like a um, Number 7 I keep going to 7 and 2 for Gaila because um, the characters are very very similar You see that um Many of them are looking like sevens, letter T, small t. In this case, it looks like a number seven only with a, that there's like a, a diagonal line on it. So, na, ni, nu, na, ni, nu, seven, like a seven, nu, nu with a, uh, nu is a seven with a, a diagonal line. Uh, going across it. Seven new. Seven new. Seven new. Okay. Next one is the. So we've done na, ni, nu, ne. This is ne. How does ne look? It ne looks like. Again. To go back to. A cross between. Maybe the seven and then the T. You see, there's like a line across it, and then it looks like it has a little bit of a. Uh, it's not a dot, but it's a very very short vertical line on top. And what would you call that? But okay, no, 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 nani no, ne. So that's ne. Ne is. I don't know uh, what I could um, tell myself to help me remember it. If you think of something, just tell me also. But it has like a, like a seven and also like a T. The line looks like more vertical than kind of going across like the seven. It's kind of hard to tell. But. Yeah, a combination of T and uh, 7 and with a little bit of a short, very, very short, almost like a dot, a line on top of the, uh, uh, the, the horizontal line on top. That's Ne. Ne. And the last one, the N series, No. No. No, there's no leaf. It looks like a leaf that has fallen, right? Or starting to drop from the tree branch. And so just think of a leaf. Yeah, leaf looks like a leaf. No, there's no, no more leaf. No more leaf. No, the leaf. Okay, so we've done the na, cross na. Seven with that uh, of diagonal line. Ne. Can't. Um, we not thought of something to help us remember it yet. And then no, no leaf, no leaf. Then we proceed to the next line. Ta. And for the T series, T series of sounds and characters. Ta. Ta looks like. Oh wow, yeah, like a seven, here we go again with a seven, or I'd say, and a seven is also like a nine, why am I saying nine, because uh, uh, the top part, it's kind of, it's not round at all, but at least it's not just seven, like two uh, two lines, one being horizontal, the other is diagonal. No, it has like a little head. It makes it kind of a nine. So, ta. Ta nine. Nine ta. Nine ta. Nine ta. Ta. Nine ta. T-A ta. Nine ta. Looks like nine ta. Okay. Ta. T. Now, this is 
the one that looks like a uh, cross between 7 and T because imagine you wrote oh no uh, yeah that's right looks like 7 and T combined um, letter T write the letter T and then add add um, another horizontal line not in the middle part but kind of a little, a little bit above that so that will give you the ta t sound t so will help you remember ta t write the letter t for t and then add another line across ta t ta t t that's t okay uh ta t two 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 likes uh, looks like a smiley face, right? Two. You're smiling too. Two. Two. Think of two smiling. Two. You're smiling too. You see the two eyes. Ta ti two. Two eyes. And then um, that person who's smiling. Ta ti two. 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 Two smile. Two smile. Ta ti two. Two. Then te. Te. This time with te, it looks like just the letter T, but you added to, but you added, uh, you added a line on top. It's shorter than the top line, so it's a uh, you added a horizontal line on top, and that makes it uh, the te. Te. So uh, if you're to contrast T and te, T is more like. You wrote the letter T, and then you add a line kind of above the uh, midpoint of the vertical line, and that's your makes it a T. T I sound T. The T is like you write the letter T, and then the on top of the horizontal line, a shorter horizontal line that you write across also so that makes it a te t versus te and the last one the to to uh, one slash down or one horizontal line uh, one vertical line and then um, uh, you write a um, from left, you write a little stroke downwards, but it's an angle of maybe uh, 15 degrees. So that's your to, to, ta, ti, to, ta, ti, tu, te, to. Again, seven, ta, ta, nine. Think of nine, ta, nine. Uh, T, letter T, and then a line across, uh, more like under the top, top horizontal. Ta, T, two, two, there's someone, a smiley face, two, and then T, letter T again, but you had the line above the one that above the top horizontal that makes it confusing but anyways um, yeah that, that's a t and then toe is a uh, line down one line down meaning that's a vertical stroke and then um from the left you make another stroke uh it's going to be horizontal at a 15 de 15 degrees going down Okay, so now we got S, the S sound, sa, si, su, se, so, sa, sa, e, uh, two letter T's, and um, T to the right looks like it's longer, and it has a tail, sa, sa. Sa, sa, sa. Okay, so just remember that two crosses 
yeah, two crosses, but the cross on the right is not a perfect cross. It has a tail. It's kind of supporting the other, kind of supporting the other T to the to its left. Sa, sa. Next sa si. Sa si, sa si. Sassy. Uh, now we, we encounter a uh, similar looking character. It's like the smiley face too. But uh, the eyes, look, imagine the eyes, they're kind of more slanted, slanted left. So sassy compared to the two which is also a smiley face, but I guess the eyes are kind of more, it's, yeah, upward looking, and the other slanted, yeah, they're more upright, I should say. This is tough, sa, si, sa, si, okay, so it's si, this person can see you, but, uh, uh, the eyes are slanted to the left. Sa si su su s u su. It's like a number seven, and it has a tail. Seven with a tail. Su su seven with a tail. Su seven with a tail. Think of su seven with a tail. Sa su. So we get the sa. Double cross, C, uh, can see you, it's a smiley face, Sa Si Su, seven with a tail, and Se, Se is uh, a T, small letter T. Se, te, se, te, small letter te, small letter te makes the sound of se, small letter te makes the sound of se, okay, se, se, letter te, se, te, okay, and just to just even confuse us more, the last character in the S series is uh, for so, Oh, it's, this would be easier then because uh, we'll call it the Cyclops. Cyclops, because it's a smiley face with only one eye that you see. The Cyclops. So, he's so much, he's so Cyclops. So, so Cyclops. So Cyclops. So think of, um, um, if you're a fan of um, Marvel, the X-Men, he said, oh, you're so Cyclops, Cyclops, one of the X-Men, Cyclops, so Cyclops, so Cyclops, smiley face with just one eye, so Cyclops, so, reviewing the so series, sa, uh, two T's, um, and with a T, with a T to the right having a tail, Supporting or sustaining the, t the cross on the le on its left side, sa si the smiley face it sees you, but uh, kind of slanting more to the left. Seven, I uh, know let's say seven and su su is the seven with a tail. Su seven with a tail. Su seven with a tail. Sa. Sa, ah uh, no, that's se, se te, se te, letter T, small letter T, se, se, small letter T, small letter T, 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 and so, so Cyclops, so Cyclops, you get that, okay. Next, we get the K, K series. We got Kakiku Keko, Kakiku Keko, Ka, 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 Ka. Um, first Ka, first character that you see, 
think of karate karate so this character looks like it's getting ready to make a uh, a sidekick so think of that ka that's a ka ka look at uh, how this person's getting ready to do a sidekick right you see there's the uh, uh it's, you know, the legs, two legs, and then the whole character, the uh, vertical line on the right, is just getting ready to snap a kick, either side or front kick. Ka, karate, ka, look at that, ka. And next one, ki, ki, ka, ki, ki. It looks like a letter. Oh no, it looks like uh, an actual ki, right? They have those. Um, two horizontal lines and then crossed with one vertical line and that makes for a good key you can um, open doors with that key key look at the key it looks like a key it's a key ka key ka key ku ku uh again one of those characters that look like a number seven Ka ki ku 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 seven. Okay, just think of ku seven. I know it'll be confusing because you've seen other um, characters that look like a number seven, but let's just hold ku seven. How can we remember this? I just thought of the answer. It's um, it looks like a number seven, but you put a um, a number seven that's wearing a cap, right? Look at it. It has that. Little cap, ka ki ku. Okay, so it has a cap and it's keeping itself cool. It's keeping itself cool. A seven that's keeping itself cool by wearing a cap. Seven ku. Seven cool. Seven cool. Seven cool is ku. Ku. Ka ki ku. Ka ki ku. That same character that we were looking at, um, the cool, but then I guess it's even cooler because it has what well, um, the cap has a long visor, or or maybe this person's wearing. I didn't get to be cooler. Okay, okay. It's okay. Okay. Oh, looking cool because um, this person has longer hair. You see, there's uh, the line there seems to extend more to the right. The uh, the horizontal line extending more to the right. It makes it cooler. It's cooler than cool. But the sound, it makes it okay. Okay. The cool seven... The cooler seven, let's call it the cooler seven is K. K, cooler seven, why? It's a number seven wearing the hat, but um, the hat extends further to the right, um, keeping the wear, um, make, making the wear cooler, keeping it nice and cool. Okay, cool, cool, cooler, but that's the sound, the sound is K. Ka, oh, okay, so ka, and we're ka, karate, ki, looks like a ki, ku, a seven that's cool because it has the cap on, ke, the cooler, it's a cooler, cooler seven because it's got, it's, uh, it's wearing a wider hat, the sound is ke. And then the last is ko. Ko looks like um, a C, letter C, was looking looking the other way, right? So ko, think of ko as the inverted C. Inverted C. You see how you'd write the letter C? You go like, um, well, sounds kind of round, but if you're just dealing with the 
straight lines it's um yeah basically look just looking the other way see flip it it look the other way that's ko so ko the c reverse c ko is a reverse c so you can hear ko reverse c so reviewing all the ka ka series ka karate the character that's getting ready to deliver a sidekick ki looks like a looks like a ki ka ki ku the cool seven ku cool seven k a cooler seven because of the wider hat that it's wearing wider hat and ko inverted c um next one two three five two three okay we got 30 so the next one is the uh what do we have here all the vowels okay yeah makes it easier ah ah uh, unfortunately i go with a seven and it looks like a seven but the difference not quite a seven but kind of looks like a seven um it looks a little strange though but um, the strange seven ah it looks strange it's a seven the strange seven ah e i e e uh so try to imagine you wanted to write the capital i but you forgot the um the bottom the bottom um, horizontal line so that's your e and then the top line the top horizontal is also kind of like slanted so ah e ah e letter i missing the bottom line and then the um, top line is slanted ah e ooh ooh look at how ooh is it's it's a seven it is a seven again it's a seven with a hat and it has a bun on top that's a bun yeah we'll call it a bun because it's not really a circle or a dot and it's not long enough to be called a line but at best it's a bun ooh you you with a bun hey you you with a bun you bun you you're the seven with a bun and you also seem to have a little hat there too okay so you seven with a bun and a hat you seven with a bun and a hat ah e ooh ah the strange seven e is the uh, letter i missing the bottom line and top line is slanted you you are the seven with a hat and a bun and a a e u a is the letter i it really looks like an i hey, look at it i slash down and then uh, across top and bottom that's i the sound it makes so it's a a e u a a is the i a is the i okay next o o this is a, it looks very unique um let's see but i'm going with t it looks like it reminds you of a t t and um it has a uh diagonal line um, on the left side so t with a diagonal line on the left side that's o o o so the vowel series vowel series ah ah the strange seven ah e uh you wrote you were trying to write i but you're in a hurry so you forgot the the bottom line and then the top was slanted Ooh. U, U, seven with a bun and a hat. A is the letter I. A sound is, it looks like E, but pronounce it A. But yeah, this letter A. A, 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 A sound. But it looks like letter I. O, T with the, uh, what do you call that? That, um, that line, the uh, diagonal line. Okay.
Okay, so this is a good review for now. Thank you.